Hi everyone, so today I'm gonna be playing Dawn of Man and I'm gonna start a new game as Hardcore and, and I would like to show you how I actually um, build a Hardcore base uh, with um, no, uh, no, Nomad starting conditions. Nomad means that you have no structure, like you don't have any beginning structures or any you know extra resources or anything you just start you know pretty much with nothing and uh, it's it's not easy like to be honest with you I tried this before and I kind of wiped uh, <laughs> many times because everything you do at the beginning is more important than what you do after after that so I'm gonna show you how I um, build my, my my hardcore based base at the beginning of the game Spongebob village okay <laughs> So I'm going to be going here, uh, let me see, yeah, I'm going to start here, so Hardcore Nomad, here we go. Yeah, and there's a way to play in the beginning, um, I'll show you some tips, like it's very important to do it the right way because like your people can die from the start, technically, and you don't want that to happen. And um, let's see how it is, okay, so now one thing you have to remember, I cannot pause the game like in, in in regular mode you can pause the game but here if I press pause it doesn't work you see so uh, I gotta be fast first of all I'm gonna go with this guy over here I'm gonna change this to this and I'm gonna change this to this guy over here this gonna be this and this gonna be this alright here we go so now uh, I'm gonna start with uh, collecting stuff over here over here uh, also here okay collecting uh, first of all I'm gonna have to build some some buildings because if I don't they're gonna be very angry so let's start with this guy over here like here let's say here another one over here no another one over here now let's go with uh, crafter okay let's go with this guy over here uh, let's go with this guy over here no let's go with storage wood storage let's put it like over here and stone storage let's put it like over here okay now let's go um, there's another one that's important, this guy over here, that's very important. Skin dryer, let's put it like over here, okay. Mm, actually, yeah, we're gonna make some, um, this is the mo This is more important, skin dryer and crafter, I'd say, and this guy, a tent, uh, wood pile as well, I would say, and well, this guy, well, they're all important, but these are the most important for now. Um, what else do I want? Basic storage tent that will be for later on. So now what you want to do is you want to make sure you gather the right stuff. Flint, uh, it's going to be here. This guy over here. Uh, I already took this guy over here. The fishing. I need some stone. Stone will be here. Okay, and... What about flint? No, I already took flint. What about this guy? Yeah, it's already there. Now, you, you gotta notice something. It says that I want one person to actually gather, uh, you know, like um, sticks. But one person, if you double check this guy over here, it's mostly kids. Okay, so they can gather one. They have one additional slot. So they're gonna have one stick with them, I think, or two. Is it two or one? Two, I think it's. Hmm. She has one. Okay, maybe somebody else used another stick. Let me see. <laughs> anyway, so the more slot they have, like adults, they have more slots. So if an, an adult were to gather sticks, you will get more sticks out of it, right? So uh, adults, they're more into building and hunting. So right now, see this guy is almost AFKing, so he's not doing anything. Uh, what I'm going to need, I'm going to need to kill an animal. Uh, but the animals I want to kill... Is not the green one. Don't kill. Don't go for the green ones. You're gonna waste your time because they run too fast, and you may or may not get it. So I'm gonna go with the bear over here. I'm gonna go with this guy. Uh, the orange one are are good for um, you know like uh, a task, 
as in an automat automatic hunting task in a sense that there will be two hunters that will come and attack him if you go for the red ones the red one are the most the most dangerous oh well if they're small there you can you can you can do it but i don't suggest that you hunt it because all the others gonna you know they're gonna butt rape you and you don't want that to happen if there was uh, a rhino a rhino or a bear like a red bear or red rhino by red i mean you know like they're they have their red color uh, I would actually send three of my uh, three of my uh, adults, three of my adults, to actually uh, kill the bear or the rhino because two alone is not enough, but three is good enough. Three is good to actually kill uh, a red bear from the start or a red uh, rhino. Okay. So now uh, let's see what we have. We're gonna advance this. Uh, see. This is, I need to have t at least uh, one, two, three housing. So now, but the thing is, you, you don't, you want to keep this as b below 150%. The higher you go, the more unhappy your, your village, your villagers will be. So if they're unhappy, they will be less productive. So it's kind of a waste, you know what I'm saying? So you don't want to put too much task at this as well. Also, you want to go here and double check what you need and here. I'm gonna go with five. I'm gonna go with five. I'm gonna go with two. Uh, that sounds about right. I'm gonna go with a hundred percent. I'm gonna go with five. Uh, five as a starter, because the thing is, if you put too much, it's kind of it's it's kind of useless because they're gonna be overworking for nothing. Uh, Ten sounds sounds about right. Five is about right. This I'm going to change later on, so this doesn't matter. Well, it does matter in a sense because if you do too much, well, 10 is enough. If you do too much, they're going to, like I said, the more you do, the more they, they will be overworking. And it's not a good thing because they will be unhappy. And like I said, if they are unhappy, they will be overworking, which is not good. And here you don't want to have unlimited. That's not good at all. Well, I'm going to change them now since I'm here with you. This is going to be like... Um, Usually I go for, for 15. Why did I go 20? 15. For, as a starter, I go with 15. And after that, I, I slowly go up if I can. This guy go for 10. This guy go for 10 usually. It depends on the space that I have. It depends on some factors. It depends if I can feed them, etc. So I'm going to have to change that later on. This I, will, I may change later on as well. And there you go. So let's see where we are. Did we kill the, uh, the bear? Yes, we did. So uh, I need someone to actually come and cut him. So now we're gonna fast forward this. As you can see, let's go check at his happiness. See, he's that's pretty good actually. That's pretty good. But it's about to go ugly unless unless I build a storage. And I need this guy to be done right now. Uh, okay. How many sticks? Do I have three stick. All right. I think sticks are more important right now for building what I need to build as a starter. So I'm going to bring two people over here. So I need more sticks gathered at this, at, uh, you know, at the same time. So I, so my adult can actually start building what I need them to build. See, right now I will need this here, dry skin, and dry skin cannot be done unless I do this one over here. So that's why it's, it's uh, unless this is built, I cannot build anything else because if I want to build a storage or if I want to build a tent it requires dry skins over here and the thing is nobody is building it I don't know why because I don't have enough dry stick uh, I don't have enough sticks and the reason I don't have enough sticks because I don't have enough people that gathers them gathers them so I have two people let me see okay so he's gonna gather more sticks this guy that's good uh, where's the other one I saw another one okay this is a kid okay see? see he's gonna gather more sticks that's good this one as well so now I'm going to have more sticks, meaning I'll be able to build what needs to be built faster. You got to be strategic because if you don't, you may even get attacked by raiders, like not now, but I think later on. But if you, you're too slow, <laughs> you, you may get attacked by anything. Animals, wild animals usually attack me like at this time. Uh, I don't want you don't do not attack the, the green guys because you're going to waste your time. They're going to be running away. And uh, you will, you may or may not catch them, and you'll be wasting your time. And your villagers will be hungry. You may want to attack these guys, but it only only if they attack you. If they attack me at my village, it's okay. But if I go after them, that's not good because then I will be overwhelmed by their um, 
you know, by the, um, I call it the, not the clan, by the, uh, the entire family, and, uh, the, I, I won't have enough villagers to attack to support, uh, my hunters, meaning if they attack over here, I have everybody here who can, well, I mean the adults, who can actually support whoever is being attacked by a uh, yeah, uh, cave hyenas. These ones are dangerous, you gotta be careful. Uh, I see there's a bear over here, the bears I was talking about, this guy. Yeah, I would bring three people to kill him. Do I need it right now? Let me see. Uh, they're building right now. Do I have food? Wait, where's my... Wait a second. Production. Skin dryer. Yeah, no. Okay, I do have food. I have three fish, eight meat. But they're they're gonna they're gonna die certainly because I don't have a dryer. I don't have a food dryer. Okay. Um, okay. There's uh, someone here who can be killed if if I actually bring everybody over here and actually just fucking kill this guy. Come on, come on. So if they are close like that, it's okay. See, there you go. Good. So now I have extra meat, extra extra raw skin, extra whatever. Extra bones, extra yeah, that's good enough. So for now, they need to rest. See the this guy wants to sleep. Oh, I have a lot of. Uh, why doesn't he put it there? Look, put it there. Oh no, he's gonna build this. Good. Okay, I'm gonna fast forward this a little bit. So now I have enough. Oh 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 oh! Oh shit, they're coming. Wait a second, I'm gonna have to attack them now because they're gonna attack me. I think. I have a feeling they're gonna attack me. It's better that I attack them first. There we go. Oh shit, they killed one of mine! Son of a gun. No, 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 don't run away. Come, come, come here. Kill these, this guy. No, I have only... Oh shit. <laughs> or maybe... You know what? Fuck it. That's it. Oh, wait, 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 wait. This guy. Kill this guy. Kill this guy. No, no, no. If he is in the water, you can kill him easier. Faster, I mean. Ah, oh, shit, too late. But anyway, I think he's about to die. There we go. Kill this guy now. You have to kill these hyenas because they can actually really hurt you if you don't kill them. If they attack you by surprise, you're dead. There we go. See, now now I'm good. Now I can actually... I have enough meat. I have enough whatever. Uh, I'm going to have to build a funeral thing here. What do you call Spiritual thing. That's important as well. Very important. I'm going to put it like here. Okay, that's good. I'm going to have to build this as a priority because people are angry because someone died. So to make them happy, I need this guy over here. I want to see what's his happiness. This guy's happiness. Oh, he's she's happy. He's happy. He's happy too. Okay, it's not the end of the world. Still. But this is a priority as well. We'll see about that. Okay, I need this guy here. Uh, I'll make a priority. Dry skins needs to be done. ASAP. Uh huh. Alright, so I did build. I have enough houses almost but I need to build another house while there's nothing else to do like this okay like here pretty much here there we go oh shit I forgot my bad all right here we go and also, you gotta check sometime, uh, you know, what you have in your inventory. You know, if you have enough, with enough uh, tools, enough knives, you know, enough everything. You gotta check that. So I checked that over here. Okay. Wooden spear for that's good. Okay. And since everything is being constructed, I will now go with the storage. Now I can go with the storage now because this is, these are the basic. What you see right now is the basics. If I don't have all these things, it's not good. So now I can go with the storage. Uh, I think I'm gonna put him right here. It's good to put the storage storage near, um, you know, the skin dryers, the food dryers, dryer, uh, anything that has to do with food, you know, um, like storage. Uh, sorry, not storage, like production, like. Um, 
This guy over here, food dryer, mortar, mortar, tanner, uh, even well. Yeah, and then then you would put the the, the wood storage and the rock pile near the storage as well. Yep, it is super important. So now I'm gonna fast forward. Now I gotta double check. I got 12 raw skin. Okay, uh, raw skin. Okay, that's good. Okay. Where is it? Oh, and I have to upgrade this. I have to upgrade this. I completely forgot to upgrade these things. These are very important. Uh, there we go. So I need to build this one. You don't need to build the flint spear. I suggest that you, because you already have the boon. Uh, sorry, you have the bone spear instead. Uh, so yeah. So it sees the same stats as this one. The only thing that flint is harder to get. So so you don't want to you know use this for flint. Uh, you don't want to use your flint to be, to build a spear. You want to use it to build axes and picks, and that's it. Uh, the rest, well, you just. You know, you can use sticks to build wooden spear, wooden harpoon, just in case you don't have bones. Uh, bones, how much do I have? A five. So, I, yeah, I'm going to leave it as it is right now because I don't have enough resources of everything in order to, to confirm that I'll be able to have, you know, to, to make bone spears and bone harpoon. So, I'm just going to leave it as it is. Uh, also, cutting trees. I'm gonna have to cut these trees unfortunately I love trees but <laughs> you know I have to uh, make sacrifices now uh, I think here there we go so here I can put two people or even yeah two people is good enough no storage left no worries about to come uh, harvest uh, Harvest, you don't want to go too far. Be careful on that. You don't want to go too far. Shit, I want this guy over here. This guy. The uh, this. So I'm going to go like this. And I'm going to put two people over here as well. Uh, sorry. Acorn, alright. And this is chestnut. What is this? Pear tree. Okay. Uh, I'll put another one just because it's you know just beside me. So I'll put another one over here. This guy is well placed, so I have emmer, lentil, service tree. I don't know what that is. Oops. What is acorn? Barley. Okay, yeah. Um, one second. I need more than just barley and acorn and stuff. I need like. Uh, here is good too. I'm gonna pick two people. Here I can put two people. Oh shit, there's the uh, hyenas. <sighs> Fuck no, can't do that because I don't want my people to die right away unless I kill them first. What is this? A wild horse, gonna waste my time because they run too fast. Okay, so I'm, I'm about as good. I can put two people over here for extra food just in case I don't have enough meat. Uh, you got double check C here. No, it's not good. So we're gonna bring that to one, and I have too much. Um, these guy over here. Yeah, I'm gonna. Uh, I'm gonna move this guy. Take this guy. And leave it as it is. Now I got too much. C it goes to 260 percent. That's too much. There, the, my people will not be productive uh, if I do that. So if you want to see what what are the next task in hand, you got to see what it is. That takes all the uh, okay, yeah, yeah. Ye flint axe, yeah. Okay, I see. So here you can you can tell what they have, what they're doing, and it the percentage here of workload depends on the amount of people you have in your camp and what you 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 ask them to do. So right now I have too much, so um right so you know what this one I'm gonna remove okay what else can I remove um, 180 okay it's going down we have no flint didn't I just yeah there it is okay hmm. so I should be okay right now I mean see now it's going down that's good it's important to do that at start because if you don't have a good start, your entire game will be uh, very complicated. Trust me. I'm gonna. I will not prioritize this. 
There we go. The, re the thing is, if you prioritize at high priority, sometime your villagers, uh, they will, instead of go sleeping or eating, they will prioritize working on this before they eat or before they sleep, which is why sometimes you will find out that they die at a certain point and you'll be like, hey, why don't you just go eat? Well, that's because you, you make this as a high priority before everything else. So this guy cannot eat, cannot sleep. So that's why you don't want to put anything on high priority unless you really, really, really need it as a high priority now. So this guy, I need this guy here as a high priority. But I don't have any of this, so that's why I need this. Uh, maybe I should make a s second one. Uh, no, one is enough. So I see it went to 140%, meaning that my villagers are happy. See, there, this is very good stats. Also, I w I'm going to need to have this uh, clothing. Let me see where they are. Uh, yeah, I think I'm going to need this, to be honest with you. Um, I, I mean, I'm going to need another one. That's what I was saying. Here we go. And I might need another crafter as well. Do I need another crafter? Uh, one is enough. Okay, here we go. Let's fast forward this and see how it is. It went back up. Okay, now it's back down. That's good. Now also be careful. Uh, something I want to show you. See the trees. Do you need to have five of this? Do you need to have ten of this? I need five of this right now. So, Because it, the more you have, the more people are going to be working on something they don't need. So I'm going to put one over here because I don't really need rocks. In all honesty, I don't need rocks. Mm, what else I don't need? I need this, I need cheese, doesn't matter. Yeah, that's pretty much it. I think 10, 5 is good. 2 is good. 5 is good. Here we go. So because my, my client is so small, I don't need to have too much of everything. You know what I mean? So here I have the school pole, which is good for you know when people are unhappy. So the more the more happy you see them, the more productive they are, just to let you know, like I said at the beginning. So now you also have to consider the food. How long has it been that you have hunted food? See, the meat is about to die, I'm pretty sure. Let me double check where's the meat. Oh, cured meat? How is it cured? I don't even have anything to cure it. What the fuck? Uh, how did I cure the meat? See, this is mysterious because I don't even know how I cured the meat. Is it, did they do it through here? I don't know. I, I don't even have the um, the food dryer. Like, how did they cure the meat? I don't. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe they. I don't know. There's maybe it's that's weird. <laughs> well, you know what? I don't complain. I, I'm not complaining. I'm just saying it's weird. <laughs> okay, so let's keep going. The other mistake, I just want to say, when people start, they, you would use this, you know, people, they're going to do this, they're going to put it here, they're going to put it here, you know, they're going to go with, uh, I don't know, fishing, they're going to put fishing here, fishing there, fishing there. Don't do that at the beginning. The more you put these kind of uh, thing, these work area, the more it's going to, the, the workload's going to be higher because you'd make them work too much, you understand? And your clan, I only have six people, four adults technically. How many adults do I have? One, two, three, four, four adults, two kids. So see, I don't need to put a bunch of stuff, unnecessary stuff. I just need what I need. And I'll, you got to make sure that you don't overburden yourself by asking them to gather too much of resources that you don't need. You understand? That's the most important. Same thing with the, um, the thing here. If you don't need some of these stuff, you just take them off, right? But for now, I'm okay with all what I see. So I'm okay right now. No storage store left. Yeah, that's because I don't have this, but because I don't have... Okay, it's coming. See, now I have... Yeah, I have more uh, dry skin coming now. That's good. It's very good. Uh, now that I'm at 60%, I can start hunting them because my food is also going low. So where's my... Uh, I need to hunt something. The, the bear. No, the rhino. Here's the rhino. Uh, that for that, I'm going to need uh, three adults. Where are all my adults? Oh, there's one over here. Okay, yeah. I'm gonna no, I'm gonna hunt this guy instead. Ancient bison. Yeah, that should be enough. Just him alone, perhaps. Yeah, just him alone should be okay. What is this? Young K. No. I don't wanna. I don't wanna go for the hyenas. 
hyenas because they're going to kill me. I want to go for this guy, but he needs to be closer to the village so that I can uh, control manually three of my hunters, three of my adult people to actually kill him. Because if I go too far and one of my hunters dies, I mean, I'm going to be down to five people and that's not good at all. <laughs> yeah. Now I'm going to see where's my bison again. He's there. Yeah, I should be okay. Let me see. I'm going to fast forward this and see what happened. I'm going to see if anyone's going to go hunt him. Oh, don't forget I also have fish. So fish also can help me to avoid being too hungry. Wait, what happened? Oh, storage. Okay, that's good. Now I have storage. Okay, that's good. Also, by the way, storage. Later on, I'm going to have to remove food and drink over here. Because it... And also uh, materials. I oh, know, I mean food and drink. I'm going to remove that from storage. And, then, and I'm going to put it in the... Um, not this guy. What am I doing? Uh, this guy. In storage, no. A granary. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna put them. So you don't want to put food in there, because you want to leave it leave place for the other stuff. You understand? So that's important to to remember. Okay, wait a second. So they're gonna go hunt the bison. Okay, okay. Let's see how it goes. Come on, come on, get him, get him. Ah, oh, shit! The rhino is just there. I hope the rhino will not attack me. Seriously, I'll be so pissed. There's a traitor. That's it, that's it, that's it. That's it. He's about to die, he's about... Well, he was about to die. He's about to die. There we go, here we go. There we go. Hey, one more, one more! Oh, guys! What the hell's wrong with you? Why you run away, you shit... Freaking piece of... Ding dong! No, 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 no. I didn't say you could leave. What is this? A woolly rhino? No. I didn't say you could leave. Go back there. Trader, I have nothing to trade, my friend. So it's useless that you're here. So I'm gonna send my. You see, you have to manually double check that because if you don't, they're gonna run away, and I need them to kill that freaking bison. There we go. See, now he's dead. Now I have meat, raw skin, and bones. For now, that's good enough for my six people clan. <laughs> you don't want more than that because you need them to rest, and you know they need to kind of chill out a little bit otherwise they will be angry and they might die from a disease or something oh there's a bear over here shit but I can't because all my what is he doing oh no that's the that's the wait what is this oh that's another rhino okay wait I could I could attack this guy actually can I no I can't I could attack the rhino over here but I need more uh, hunters around Wait a second, I got this guy over here. Um, I could, but I won't. No, 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 I, I'm gonna let them relax a little bit because seriously, it's not good to over overload them with work. So I'm gonna fast forward this. So you see, this is a very good beginning. This is a very good basic, base, um, uh, base village. In a sense that everybody's happy, you have the basic stuff, you know, you, you gradually work on what you need. I have pretty much everything I need right now, so all my... This is good, this is awesome. <laughs> now, uh, what you need to do is to is to build more... more. Um... See, the thing is, when you build these things here, you get like stars, prestige. So if you want more people to, to come in your clan, you need more prestige. So in other, in other, in other words, you need to build more, more stuff. So what am I going to build? Oh, wait a second. I forgot to see if I have... Okay, four. All right. Next thing I'm going to do is food drying. So I need one more point. So um, what about storage? Do I need that? Let me see. I might need that later on, actually. Storage. Yeah. But right now, I think I'm going to build uh, a tent. A residence, sorry. Like that. There we go. I like to have a circle, you know, kind of village <laughs> because it looks so. Uh, <laughs> it looks more tribal. What is this clothing? Yeah, I know, but I can't. Where's the clothing? I need tanning, but I cannot do tanning. Oh shit! Winter's coming. God damn it! Yeah, now I. No, yeah, so I need to build that uh, tanning thing. Where is it? No, I can't because I need to unlock it, which is here. This guy over here. Oh shit! My life. Oh shit my life, if I don't do this, people will die. 
Uh, how do I my? Uh, you know what? I need to hunt something. I need to do something. Wait a second. Um, uh, that's messed up because now I don't know what to. Hmm. Hmm. All right. I could actually now have this guy over here and have two of them. That. I could actually go try to hunt uh, this guy over here, a reindeer. Okay, that's good. All right, here we go. Well, now I just need to have an extra points in order to get the tanning here to make the clothing. Or I'm gonna get a point right here for just I'm gonna get a point by just making this building. Oh, there we go. All right, I got the point. That's good. Tanning. Here we go. I need this shit. I'm gonna make it a high priority now because I need these clothing here. Seriously speaking. So I need. Oh no! Oh, I'm such a ding dong because I need the um, Morthor. Uh, Morthor. Ah, where is it? No, wait. Jesus, potatoes. Where is it? Yeah, I need this guy over here. Okay, so. Uh, I'm gonna put him like here. I'm gonna make this a high priority. Come on guys, build, 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 build. Good shit. That's good, that's very good shit. Now I'm gonna need you to do this, and then do this. There we go. Oh! I need the, 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 the thing here, this. Tan and God. Cheese potatoes. Okay, here. There we go. I'm gonna make another one as well. Uh, how about here? There we go. Okay, now I need to gather. Come on, guys. Come on, come on, come on. It's about almost winter. Where is the... Yeah, it is winter right now. Shit, people will die. Uh, while they're not gathering, I'm going to tell them, some of them to hunt. Uh, I'm going to tell them to hunt this guy over here. There we go. Okay, they're in good mood, that's good. Now, also, I'm gonna remove this uh, hunting guy, fishing. I'm gonna use bones now. There we go, that's good. Winter escape, really? Reindeer escape? Did you escape? Son of a gun. I'm gonna get you back. Okay, here we go. Now there's a storm. Gotta be careful. I got a point. So guys, uh, this pretty much is a very... Bleh, this is a very good starting uh, game that I just did right now. As you can see, this is hardcore mode, and if you don't start the way that I started, uh, specifically if you don't, if you took nomad, nomad uh, setting, you're gonna be in deep trouble because you you got to build the right stuff from the start in order to uh, survive what next what comes next. So right now, you see, I need to have those clothing up. These thing needs to be done, but then I need this guy over here, which for some reason is not being done. Oh, because I have no tannin, god damn it. Which I don't know why nobody's gathering them. Is there anyone gathering the tannin? Oh, that's because there's none, I think. Because I have. Oh my god, don't tell me I have to wait until spring. Holy shit, that's a big. Oh my god, so that's problematic. See? So everything needs to be done in a. <laughs> 
you gotta do things the right way, otherwise you're in deep shit. So now I'm in deep shit. I don't know if um, I, well, winter is almost finished, and I have nine people. That's great. Three people just came. Oh, that's good. So uh, yeah, but still, you know, I'm I'm lucky that nobody died in winter. To be honest with you. So yeah, guys, just be careful if you like this video, and if it helps you to understand how to play hardcore, hardcore, uh, hardcore mode, uh, and um, nomad setting. Uh, please like and sub, and um, I'm gonna go do another video later on about this game, about the how I'm gonna continue playing, and to evolve in this uh, this mode, this hard code, hard hardcore mode. All right, guys, thanks for watching. Peace.